Hi, this is Mick. Um, here's a new uh, addition from WinCNC. If you have Window WinCNC 2.6, uh, 2.6 is for Windows 8. Um, it also runs on Windows 7. Um, I'm running Windows 7. Windows 6 is not a free. Uh, Win WinCNC 2.6 is not a free upgrade. Uh, you'd have to contact CamMaster for an upgrade um, price. I really don't know what it costs. You cannot run WinCNC 2.6 without the, a new file from, from CamMaster, so I wouldn't try it. But if you have WinCNC 2.6, there's now a new test version. WinCNC 2.6. There's a test version um, on the WinCNC.net website. And what that test version is, is in Aspire, I've drawn a 10 inch by 10 inch square with a 8 inch circle. I've created my tool paths. Um, let me move the screen across. I've created my tool paths. I've got my file, um, I've saved it, if I go to WinCNC, if I go to uh, File, Open, I get my uh, tap file, it's called Material Border, if I go to View It, um, you'll see here a orange square, if I zoom in, left mouse click hold the left mouse down draw a square I zoom in you can see an orange border this is the border of my material 10 by 10 so what this allows is to give you like a perspective of where you are cutting uh, on your board I say this is just an upgrade from WinCNC um, I, I like it. It shows me where I'm actually cutting. If I have a 4 foot by 8 foot sheet, I can visually see where all the parts are going to go. Um, you guys know, obviously, left mouse click, draw a square, you zoom in. You hold shift and left or right mouse click, and that takes you back to the original full size. Uh, again, this is not a free version. Um, contact Cam Master don't try to download the uh, WinCNC 2.6 test version it won't run on your machine as I said you need a file from Cam Master so hope this hope you hope you enjoy this thanks bye